The first method is to highlight your station in Somatic Manager and select the PLC menu. Choose Diagnostic Setting. Then select Module Information. When the Module Information tool opens, select the Diagnostics Buffer tab. Let's observe a second way to get to the Diagnostics Buffer. You must be parked at the station level or below in your project. Then press and hold the Control key plus the D key. This opens up the CPU's Module Information tool. Then select the Diagnostics Buffer tab. Let's see a third way to get to the Diagnostics Buffer tab. Right-click on the Blocks folder from your Somatic project. Select PLC and choose Module Information. Then select the Diagnostics Buffer tab. Next, let's see how to get to the Diagnostics Buffer from the Hardware Configuration Editor. Select your station. Double-click Hardware. In the Hardware Configuration Editor, you must first highlight the CPU, then select the PLC menu. Choose Module Information, and then the Diagnostics Buffer tab. And now we will observe one final method. Close the Hardware Editor. From the Blocks folder, we will open a block. How about FC14? Inside the Programming Editor, select the PLC menu. Choose Module Information. And from here, you can access the Diagnostics Buffer. In this video, you have seen methods to access the Diagnostics Buffer from Somatic Manager, from the Hardware Configuration Editor, and from the Programming Editor. See the other videos on interpreting diagnostic messages for more information. This concludes methods to open the CPU's Diagnostics Buffer.